Hello, YouTube. We actually have some drip marketing for Asapa Harumasa. Um, that's been dropped about, I don't know, like 15 hours ago or something. The, the usual like 6 a.m. stuff. And I'm very excited to have a look at him. I'm actually super surprised because I thought he would be coming out for phase two. Because I really thought they would drop like Miyabi phase one, for example. I mean, mind you, it's not guaranteed we're getting Miyabi, but with how the latest patch story ended, it seems to be showing that we are gonna start having more story time when it comes to section six, right? And Miyabi is kind of like the captain, but she seems to be the last one to come out, right? Because Sukako is out, we know that Yanagi is coming out next patch, and now we also have Azaba Harumasa. And so, I mean, it would make sense if Miyabi is the next one, right? So first and foremost, we do have the agent record here, which is the little video um, showing his animation real quick and a bit of his voice, so let's see. Fancy testing my aim? That was one in a hundred, I guess. Okay, so there he is. He has a very, um, very young guy kind of voice, like, fancy, take, fancy testing my aim? That was one in a hundred. He seems very playful almost in, in the way he speaks. Um, and what I see here is that Fancy testing he my does aim. have a lot of that movements. Was one in a hundred, I guess. All right, so the movement is not amazing, right? But he has a little bit of movement on the hair, on the hand, on the coat, more importantly. And generally speaking, this means that this character is actually going to be a five-star character, an s rank agent, essentially, right? This is what we've seen before for the previous characters. So this is very likely to be the five, the s rank character of Phase 1 of 1.4, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, because I think 1.3 is going to be Yanagi and Lighter. So he is going to be 1.4 Phase 1 s rank agent. Uh, so very cool to see. And obviously here we can see that he is an electric attacker character. So if I have a look at Pride Win real quick as a, a way to have a, to have a better understanding. If we check electric characters, we only currently have Anton as a kind of DPS character, right? Uh, he is considered an attack character, but he kind of needs some amount of anomaly um, for him to be to have his full potential. But obviously, we actually don't have a attack electric uh, main DPS that is a limited character or even just a S rank character. So this is going to be very good if you do want to, you know, play around that. Obviously, here we also have Rina. Um, sorry, the website is kind of like acting sasibaka. But yeah, this is the idea here. So on paper, to me, uh, that shows that there is definitely uh, potential to, to work well with some other characters in here. Um, maybe you'll be able to like have him with some of, uh, you know, hands, um, section six squad, right? Um, Sukaku is, she does have a general buff, so they can definitely work together. Uh, and you'll also be able to like pair him up with a stun character like Shinyu, who's like very, very strong. And maybe this is the resurgence of a character like Rina. I feel like Rina, I'm literally hiding her right now, so I can't show you. She's underneath me, essentially, here. That's all you gotta care about. She's right there, see? Uh, she's currently 1.5, and I think that Rina is really underrated. I think the problem that she has is that right now, in terms of content, we haven't had really a lot of content that's required us to have electric um, elemental coverage. And the reason why is that, well, so far, we haven't had a real electric DPS, right? Makes sense. But with the arrival of a character like Yanagi and a character like uh, Asuba, Abus, Abu, Bi, 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 Arumasa, Asaba, we're definitely gonna see more enemies that are probably going to be weak to electricity. In that case, a character like Rina, who is a. Uh, she buffed the team, she can shock the team, and she has like. Um, she has. Uh, she extends the duration of shock, I think. And on top of that, she also um, have a defense shred, I believe, on the enemies, or increase the team's penetration, something like that, to that sense. I don't have her, so I didn't really go super deep into the details, but to my understanding, this actually functions. So we might see a world where Rina comes, uh, gets, you know, higher in the tier list with the arrival of those electric DPSs, right? Very exciting stuff. I could definitely see teams with maybe... Um, you know, Asaba, Shinji, and like uh, Rina just have a full-on 
mono electric kind of kind of squad in the mix in here. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm very exciting for that kind of stuff. Really, really excited to see potentially Rina coming into play uh, in the game or in harder content, right? In Shiro defense, etc., etc. So now, moving on from that, we do have a bit more information. But before we jump into the information, I do want to talk about his looks. Um, he, obviously, he, he, he looks young. He looks very... Uh, I don't know, there's something in his eyes, I think. There's something about his face that makes him seem very, very young and very... I don't want to say naive, but more maybe optimistic. You know what I mean? Um, the, the, I think the the uh, bandana, whatever you want to call it, uh, gives him kind of that uh, gung-ho look, or maybe like he's someone that does like martial arts, right? So maybe someone that's very optimistic and very like strong, but like maybe like in a simple way, I guess. It doesn't really strike me as the, the mastermind, right? And considering the team that he's in, obviously that is going to be the mom of the team, is Yanagi. But he's here, he does his job, he's excited, and he wants to do good. He seems like kind of a goody to show in a sense, I guess, but not necessarily bad. Um, to me, he really resembles Seth, uh, that he's in, you know, the, the public security. He, to me, he kind of looks like the Seth in um, Section 6, but Seth is way more serious, and he's here to learn, he's here to take notes. Meanwhile, this guy... I feel like he's like minimum effort, being lazy, but when he needs to do the work, he does the work as we saw in Yanagi's demo, right? So I do get this vibe from him. I get the vibe that he's kind of, he wants to slack, but he's not bad at his job or he's not gonna, you know, he's still gonna get the job done even if he wants to slack a little bit. So he might complain about like not getting some time off, but he'll be here to do the work when he has to do the work. That's kind of the vibe he's giving me. Uh, now, outfit-wise, very sleek. I feel like it's kind of simple. I'm not a big fan of the baskets, like the shoes he has. But the bow itself looks pretty cool. I do like the colors, to be honest. I think it's very simple, like, to have, like, some darker tones. A bit of, um, uh, the blue. I don't really know. Is this turquoise? I'm not sure. But I think it looks good overall. There's a bit of yellow. I kind of like the color yellow, to be honest. So I think it looks great. Um, interestingly enough, there's a 56 on his, uh, jacket here. But this, yeah, it is 56, so... Maybe it's a One Piece fan, you know? 56, Gomu, Luffy, all that stuff. Anyway, personally, it's not really the kind of ad feed that really works for me. It's not really the kind of design that I really find entertaining for myself, right? Um, because I think, personally, I kind of like the more of the Playboy-ish aesthetic that like an adventuring has, for example. I know, I know, I have a type, it is what it is. I think it's a bit too... I don't know, maybe he looks too young or too not freaked up enough. <laughs> I like myself I like myself a guy with trauma, okay? <laughs> now, the thing I do want to say is that his weapon is freaking cool. Because his bow is not only a bow, but as you can see, it's actually katanas, I believe, right? If you look here, those are blades. So I think it's actually two blades. You can see it here in the holsters. He actually has two um, how do you want to call it? He has two scabbard, so I think he takes out the two blades and he can combine them into a bow, which means if, I'm wondering if it's going to be a character like Yanagi who has two stances. Is he also going to have a stance where he just attacks with dual blades and then he can change into a bow user? And in that sense, that kind of reminds me of a character like Child in Genshin Impact, right? Double blade, bow, all that stuff. So I'm wondering, is he gonna also have a two stance gameplay? Very interesting. I'll keep my eyes open for that because I think that has very great potential. It's kind of interesting because I feel like we see... It feels like the team from Section 6 has a lot of uh, weapons like that. He has two blades that co combines into a bow. Yanagi has a katana that can be extended to a naginata. Um, and even, I think... Shokaku, I think her weapon doesn't start immediately as a double-sided axe, right? I think it's only one side, and then it becomes a two-side when she does the massive attack, or when she throws in the, the, the blizzard, right? So I'm curious about that. I, it makes me think, like, Miyabi seems to only have just have a normal katana, so I'm very curious about the future. Now, moving on to the actual information here. So obviously, electric attack. Nice to meet you, unless you're here to make me work overtime. There it is. The, he wants to slack. 
<clears throat> I feel like my condition has worsened. I've got bags under my eyes, my body aches all over, and I feel so out of it that I'm about to mutate into an ethereal. Deputy, are you not going to give me a sick leave note? Yeah, that's what I told you. He's a slacker. He wants to slack, but he'll be forced to work and do the work. And when he does the work, he does it well. <laughs> now here, he's much stronger than he appears. Like spicy chicken noodle soup disguised as a cup of half-sweet tea milk. Oshimi Miyabi. So, yeah, essentially he looks weak, but he's actually very strong. She says that he's like a cup, he's like a, uh, essentially spicy chicken noodle soup that pretends to be like a sweet, half sweet tea milk. So he's stronger than he looks like. So this kind of the vibe he's giving me, right? He's like, he's a slacker, or he wants to slack, so people feel like, okay, he's just a guy that sucks, right? But actually, he put in the work. Sugaku says, how do Masa always toss the sugar packets away every time he drinks coffee? But that's okay, all the more for me. Okay, a genius. I think nothing more than a coward watching from the sideline. A, disgr a disgruntled for colleague of Harumasa. I could definitely see people being upset with that kind of attitude, right? When he was a child, he was full of enthusiasm for everything if it weren't for his master. Oh, if it weren't for his master? So something happened that made him change, right? This is what it feels like. Interesting. I'm looking forward to learn more about his background, definitely. Now moving on. All evil must be eradicated. What is evil? That's for us to judge. Ooh, okay. Yeah, I saw it's evil and I eradicate it. I don't care if you disagree. <laughs> that sounds like um, sword justice from uh, Sakazuki. Stuff like that. And here we have the full thing. And uh, yeah, overall, I think he looks pretty good. But that's not my type of character. I do like the design. What I like a lot in here. Because I feel like I'm contracting it myself. I think the weapon looks amazing. The rest, a bit too bland for my taste. Um, that's not gonna be for me, but I definitely see the appeal and why some people would be into it, right? Um, so yeah, there it is. That's my thought on him. And uh, I'm keeping my eyes peeled for information regarding a potential dual stance kind of gameplay, just like Yanagi. So yeah, anyway, let me know what you guys think. Are you gonna be saving for him? Are you gonna be pulling for him? Are you skipping him? Are you a Miyabi enthusiast? Let me know down in the comments. Like, subscribe, all the good, good, and I'll see you next time.